The phone is a tutorial of how to conceal melasma in dark circles. And if you want to see what I did in order to get this look and how I cover my melasma in my dark circles, please keep on watching. I wanted to do the video in uh, natural light and that's what I started the video. Uh, but it was getting so dark that I wasn't able to, to get the, uh, the camera to look at the right settings and everything else. So it was getting kind of dark. So uh, you're going to see the video from when I started and then I come back to my makeup room which is what I'm filming right now. So you're going to see the differences between both. Anyway, here we go with the video. Okay guys, so this is what my face looks like right now. And um, I'm going to put a little bit of um, primer on my face. So I'm going to use the No Pore, uh, no Pore Blend Prime Essence in Touch Soul. This one right here. This is really watery. But it's really, really a good one. I feel like it's not sticky. It's just very natural. So the next I'm going to do is I'm going to um, conceal my melasma. This is kind of right here, if you can see it on both sides. Like I said, the two things that I have problems with is melasma in, um, in my uh, dark circles. So I'm going to use this here, and this is alginist, and I'm just going to conceal a little bit of that. And these are corrector drops. So I'm going to use this before I put my foundation. And I'm gonna use my hand. So what I'm doing is I'm kind of color correcting the darkness. And you see this kind of like, it melts through the skin. I love this. I just got this from, I think it was TJ Maxx or Marshalls. But I love this because it just, I don't know if you can see it. I mean, I have some melasma right here. Right here, so I'm just gonna put a, a little bit of it. cover the darkness put some right here and some right there and this is supposed to color correct like I said it's just, I've been loving this this is amazing for color correcting your skin so that's not how I color correct okay now this Boja and this is a BB cream And this is the color Manhattan Beach. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of it, a few little drops. And I'm just gonna start on this side. And I'm gonna use this cover FX and I'm bouncing the brush. I'm not sweeping, I'm bouncing. This is a lighter foundation. I didn't wanna use anything too um, hard. So I decided to do something light. This is what I do to color correct my melasma. First I use a corrector and you see the difference. Next thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take care of my under eye circles. And I'm going to use this um, alginist, and this is also a corrector for under eyes. And I'm gonna use my fingers for this. So I decided to do this instead of doing it in my makeup room. I have like um, a window in front of me with no lights. I wanted to do just um, regular lights. Just regular, um, yeah, regular light. So this is what it is when you're color correct. Now I'm gonna use this Tarte Tape Shape and this is the color medium. And this one is not as light um, there is one that I have a lighter, but I didn't want to make it too light. So I am kind of um, covering, but I didn't want it to be so bright. Put a little bit here in the center, the same.
So this is how I color correct um, melasma in my under eye circles. Now I'm gonna use this powder from Nikia Joy and I'm gonna do my eyes. And I'm gonna use this to set my face. Since I have oily skin combination, I have to set everything. If not, it's gonna be like, I'll be a grease ball. Now I'm gonna contour and I'm gonna use this um, NARS and the color is Laguna. And I'm gonna bronze, and this is the hourglass. I'm gonna use this um, Patrick Ta, this one right here. This is the color she's so LA. I'm gonna use this one right here. I'm gonna use this solo one right here. This one is she's that girl. Now I'm gonna use a cream, and I'm gonna use this one right here. Then I'm gonna use the same powder. I have these drops that I bought, uh, and these are um, custom um, sculpting drops, so I'm gonna use this one here. And these are uh, Lancome. I'm gonna use these two mascaras. This one is a uh, heroin make, and this is a Lancome. And these are both waterproof. So I line my lips and I'm using this uh, Laura uh, Mercier, uh, it's like a pink color. And now I bought this and this is supposed to, um, it's like a mood lipstick and lip gloss and I'm gonna put some. Okay guys, so this is what I have so far. Um, I had to come back to my makeup room because it was getting so dark, I couldn't, the makeup wasn't looking good because it was so dark, I had to change the settings on my camera in order for the light to come through. So I was doing it in natural lighting, so I said, well, I'm gonna have to come back and so that way y'all can see the makeup. But this is what I do in order to conceal my melasma. So I have to color correct, first of all, my melasma and then my eye circles in order to, um, before I do the foundation or anything else. And I don't know if you can see it, but I, I just love it. Every time I do it, I love it. It's not, uh, like I said, I only put one layer of foundation. I could have put it a thicker layer, but I decided just to kind of keep it more soft. Um, but um, yeah, this is what I do. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching my videos.